This is a spa treatment. Okay, that sounds so exciting. So explain to me, why are you using Stella products? We're using Stella products because it has silicic acid. And most people know to keep youthful, all estheticians use silicic acid. So what we're going to do today is show you, the clientele, how you can keep your scalp and your hair youthful. Every woman, man and child, need to Fall in love with the scalp first and the hair second. That's why we're using Stella today. All right, it sounds exciting. Give us some more. Take it away, Dee Dee. Well, today we're going to do a demonstration on our model. She is a natural hair care client. Other than she has a high lift blonde. We are going to first, and this is an exclusive, we are going to do a hot oil massage with two shampoos, and a conditioning treatment, all with the Stella products. So once we get started, we will show you all of the steps. And we're doing something a little bit different today. We're coming to you, the clientele, instead of the hairstylist. Let me tell you why. We at Stella want to educate clients on what skin and scalp can do and what your hair and how your hair can flourish after you take care of the scalp. So we're doing something a little bit different. And we're gonna be doing these webinars every month. Now this webinar, for the clientele. And if you're joining us, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you join us. This will not be a question and answer today. We just wanted to demonstrate and show you and give everybody a chance to use Stella and get a great massage on their scalp. So. Right now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix our hot oils. Now these hot oils have wonderful properties. So what we're gonna do is take this hot oil and we're gonna put it in a color bottle. The reason why we wanna put this in a color bottle or a processing bottle is that we want to get to the scalp. We don't wanna spray it, we wanna get definitely to the scalp. And the way you get to the scalp is with a nozzle and not a spray. You don't need a lot of oil. This oil is blended with the best oils. We're not gonna tell you our top secret, but know that these oils all help hair to grow. I'm gonna put this down. Now, let me tell you how I fell in love with Stella. I met the owner. We talked. She is on a trichology path of hair. And with being on a trichology path of hair, that's letting me know that she's concerned with skin and scalp. This is my model, Samantha Carroll, who has given us permission and, and grace to do her hair this morning. We're going to part the hair in four sections. Over the ear, we're going to do from mid to front and from mud, from mid to edge. So once we do that, because this oil is heavy, we're gonna go down the middle. As you see, I'm demonstrating here. Have your stylist to rub that oil in. Then we're gonna do the fours. We're gonna do what we call the four corners of the earth. Now, if your person has a lot of hair and their density is thick and their strand is thick, you wanna part it in six areas. If their hair is even thicker, you want to part it in eight areas. Now, your first application of this oil is to get a good massage in. This oil, once we massage it in, we're going to put it in an endothermic heating device, which is a hair dryer. And what that's going to do is let that oil move over the scalp, down and through, and exfoliate all of the, the dry scalp, itchy scalp, dead hair, if somebody has cerberea dermatita, if someone has eczema, that gets in there, that heals that, that makes that feel better. Hot oil treatments have been a thing of, of the past. Now they need to be the thing of today. 
with people doing installations of artificial hair, whatever installation that you have, whatever braids you have, after your people come out, their scalps need this elite spa treatment. Why? Because you've got dirt, oil, debris, you've had the installation in. They have not been shampooed properly, so they're going to have a buildup of their sebaceous glands, which causes to have white flakes, yellow flakes, dry scalp, itchy scalp. And instead of just doing a regular shampoo, you need to have a spa treatment. How does that feel, Samantha? Wonderful. Right. And guess what? Wouldn't you love to sit back and let somebody oil your scalp, massage it in, relax your mind, and you know full well that your hair and your scalp are going to benefit from this? Now, you say, she didn't use a lot of this oil. If I could bring you up closer, you will see that this oil has gone all throughout her scalp. And the reason why it's gone throughout her scalp because it's a heavier oil, so it's a moving oil. A lot of oils don't tend to move as fast, heavier oils do. Don't, and you can smell the essence of real peppermint oil, real tea tree oil, and other oils that have been blended in with Stella. So as we do this, mas this massage and the scalp treatment, we're going to make sure that her nape is done up to her occipital bone, over the ears. We're going to relieve tension in the scalp from behind using rounded massage technique. And now we're going to place a processing cap over the scalp, over the hair, and we're going to move to the dryer. Why the dryer? Well, hot oils work better with heat. If you have a self-heating hot oil, you're kind of not doing what you should do. You should always sit a hot oil underneath a dryer. Steamers sometimes make the oils a little bit heavier, and water and oil don't blend. Heat and oil blend. So we're going to move to the actual dryer at this point in time. We're going to turn this on. We're going to use this on a hot dryer for 10 minutes and 10 minutes only. Welcome back everyone to Stella's Elite Spa Treatment. So Dee Dee, yes. can you tell us what you're going to do next? Now, now that we've taken our client out of the dryer, we're going to remove the processing cap, discard that, it's got oil in it, dirt and debris. We are now going to give her a massage therapy shampoo. Now, when you're doing a massage therapy shampoo, spa treatment, make sure that your client is comfortable and well draped. You want to start off not with lukewarm water, but water enough, temp it so that they can handle it. You need to remove the oil. And you're going to see a lot of different flakes. You're going to see your, soap is, your, your shampoo is going to be cloudy. That's due to the fact that we have removed and sloughed off all of the dead skin. And with sloughing off that dead skin, we are going to definitely see a pink, rejuvenated, well-adjusted, blood-circulating scalp, and that's what we want to see. You start at the bottom and rinse that hair. Oh, warm water always feels good. Always ask your client or clients, always let your operators know if the water is too warm for you. Never sit there in pain. How's that water for you, Miss Samantha? Kind of cool. We're going to up that temperature. How's that for you, Miss Samantha? Let's 
If you could see the debris that's coming off, and that's exactly what we want, especially after having an installation, any type of frontals, any type of weave, braids, and you know, the season for that, for protective hairstyling, is coming up. So, this is what you wanna be able to see. You wanna rinse, or have your stylist rinse, into your water is clear but you will still see a film in the water you just don't want to see large bubbles and all stylists should be able to learn how to read their water your water will let you know what's going on with your client's scalps You need to be a bubble sensei. Now, we're gonna do two shampoos with the same shampoo. And you say, why would you do two shampoos with the same shampoo? One, we're going to exfoliate and remove the oil. The second shampoo, with the same shampoo, will moisturize and invigorate the actual scalp. And you say, how is that possible with one shampoo? I don't know what they did, but they did it well when they did it with Stella and it does, and it works, and you don't have an oil residue left over. You see that shampoo? This is where the money's at for the clientele. I don't care if I'm the world's best stylist. If I don't know how to give a good shampoo, I don't know how to style hair. So we're gonna start off. How does that feel? Is that too rough? No, good. You can see that I'm coming down in her facial area where that foundation might have been, and behind the ears. A lot of hair dirt is trapped behind those ears and in the nape of the neck. Never with your fingernails, always with the tip ends of your fingers. Do you want to give a good shampoo? And the whole time, because this is a spa treatment, we're also massaging as we're shampooing. right now wants an invigorating massage shampoo you're worth it now let me tell you something a lot of men and women college students they don't believe that beauty should be a household bill if you make your beauty regiments your household bill and put it in your household budget you never teach yourself you treat yourself Doesn't that feel good? Yes. Doesn't that look good on camera? Uh -huh. You want to hit all four corners, sides, nape, occipital, mid, and front. That was three minutes on the shampoo. See how thick and rich my lather is? You see how cloudy that looks? That lets me know I have sloughed off all of residue off of her scalp with hot oil. Now I've gone further down. It's always best to tell your client you can always reapply your makeup. What we don't want is for you not to shampoo or to cleanse this prime area of the forehead because this will come back into the hair and cause it to actually get dirty again once we put her under the dryer, under a steamer. Get behind those ears. Look at those suds and they are powerfully cloudy because we have sloughed off everything we needed to slough off. Make sure you do proper rinses in between. And we're gonna go for the second shampoo. 
same shampoo. That silicidic acid is phenomenal. We're doing massage therapy while we are shampooing, getting that blood to circulate. This client has been blonde for a year. She loses no hair. We've been using Stella before and after all of her treatments, before and after all of her color. And she is a high lift blonde. She is a level 10. The next one is platinum. She's got some level 9s, level 10s in there. Get that forehead. Are you comfortable, Miss Sam? Yes. The whole time using massage therapy, just not shampooing. Each shampoo should be three to five minutes each. Why so long? That's not a long time. You want to cleanse the scalp, cleanse the hair of debris and oil. Now, now we're going to use what I call liquid platinum. That liquid platinum is a Stella conditioner. I use Stella conditioner after color, after relaxers, after perms, everyday use, and as a treatment. It has that many functionalities in one bottle. I like to use and move my water apparatus to move those suds away and make sure we have a good rinse. I'm short, so I'm on my tiptoes. But who wouldn't want a great shampoo? Imagine starting your shampoo when the Elite Spa treatment, you get a massage before. Your scalp is treated. You get two massages after. And then we go in with the Liquid Platinum, the Elite Conditioner, which is gonna soften the cuticle protect the scalp. This whole product is a protection product. It's like having a flat ja jacket on in the middle of war. Because remember, all the outside elements are worn against your hair and your hair growth. So imagine having that type of protection. Life insurance policy for your hair, how about that? We're all nice and clean. We're going to do a gentle patting of the hair to remove excess water. We're not going to rub hard with a towel, wring out. This is hair. I want to show you something. Coming up, Miss Sam. And get you a fresh towel.
never want to sit uncomfortable. Never, ever. Now, for the liquid gold. I have to squeeze hard. You see how thick and creamy this is? This has an emulsifier in it. So that means a little bit goes a long way. When I rub it in my hand, it gets whiter, it gets creamier. We're going to start at the nape. Now, we've done two shampoos with the same shampoo. And you say to yourself, isn't that going to dry her hair out? I've never heard of that concept before. Well, there's always something new. Different companies come out with something new. This company is built on new. We're going to place this under a steamer. You see how I'm getting to the scalp by parting? And see, clients, that's why we wanted to educate you. A little bit goes a long way. So you put a little in your hand, emulsify it, and keep going. We wanted to educate you because I hear a lot of women come to me with different questions. And they're wondering why. Why this, why that? Well, why does this stylist say this and this stylist say that? So we're going to educate you from the beginning to the end. So that way you have this type of education. Now, now that the hair is totally saturated, I'm going to show you something. I'm going to do that. We would never, ever, never, ever, never, ever comb out a conditioner with a rat tail comb. People would say, you're going to take her hair out. I want you guys to see something. Look at there. It melts all the way through. See that? I start at the bottom. I come up to the top. And I am on high lift blonde hair. Look at that comb out. She's natural. Other than the color, but where you see her root, that's all natural hair. She's natural. And I can part this hair off, right? Start from the bottom, comb it all the way. She's not losing that one strand. This is liquid platinum. Everybody wants gold, you want platinum. And this is what this is. We're gonna go back now with Miss Tracy so she can introduce you to a fabulous, fabulous, educator and an owner of a barbering college that is going to be phenomenal and on the next cutting edge. She's going to go under the steamer. We'll see you back in a moment. Go that way. Thank you so much, Dee Dee. I just really want to thank you, Mr. D, for allowing us to come in and do this demonstration with Stella Products. So if you don't mind, I'd like to ask you a couple of questions. I, I just want the public to know. Um, about your facility, um, about you, and everything that you have, you know, done and experienced in the beauty industry. So first of all, Mr. D, yes. I'd like to, for you to just tell us a little bit about your journey, your journey from being a barber to owning your own school. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes, it's been a long journey. I first started out at the age of 12 cutting hair. Mama backyard alleyway, just trying to make a dollar here or there. Started out for free. Then after that, by the age of 13, went up a dollar, 14, another dollar, 15. I was cutting hair for $5. Then at that point in my life, I had a grocery store job. I was making three twenty-five an hour. And I would work a whole week, 60 hours a week, doing overtime, and still only come out with like maybe 120 bucks or something like that. But then I realized I could make $100 in one day. So I saw a whole different vision at a young age. So once I graduated high school, my mom sent me straight to barber school. And after that, 
I went straight to the shop at the age of 18. I've been a licensed barber ever since. I've been doing this 31 years now. I have taught three different barber colleges, and now I'm running my own because, you know, I just want to train people, help create jobs, you know, so they so they could do their business. And like what Stella doing, it's about creating jobs and giving people job opportunities. I, I just advise people if they they want to get in this field, even opening a salon, I feel you should go to school and learn about the field. Don't just open a business that you're just trying to make money to open a business. If you don't have passion for your business or what you do, you know, find your passion and do that. My goodness, you're, you're giving such great advice. Um, and that's one thing that, you know, we need to understand as entrepreneurs, you know, business owners, you really have to have a passion, a heart for what you do. So um, what I want to ask you uh, is just to tell me about the discounts that you have here at the school and what services you offer. Okay. Yes, I, but we have all different services. We do like our relaxers and styles for $40. We do sewings for $50. Everyday haircuts are $10. And we also do locks and braids at the price of $35 and flat irons for $25. So if anybody want to come see us, come on down to Cold Cutters College. We got you. Make sure you're looking right. So since you've invited the public out, would you please go ahead and tell us your address? Okay. The address is 3303 Centerville Highway, Suite 12 and 13, Snellville, Georgia, 30039. Well, thank you so much, Mr. D. And that's one thing I want to tell you about cold cutters. I've, I've known D for, I don't know, maybe 10 years now. And I had the opportunity to watch him from behind the chair until owning this barber college. Well, it's cold cutters college, so cosmetologists, estheticians, uh, manicurists, you all can come here and get your education. And what wowed me was that he kept the price affordable. So if you're looking to get into the beauty industry and you're looking for a school, I tell you, please come down here and check out Cold Cutters. Right now, my client is under the steamer with her conditioner, the liquid platinum. Don't tell the secret. Don't let the secret get out or be the first one to get the secret. I'm telling you. This is going to take her hair in a phenomenal level. Remember, in, endothermic heat is a dry heat. This is a wet heat. So what that's going to do is take that liquid platinum and drive it deeper into the cuticle. Okay, I'm going to give you a secret. Don't tell anybody. If I'm a hair strand, your cuticles look like this. If they're closed shut, they cannot receive. All they do is give out dirt and oil. But when you open that cuticle level and that conditioner can get deep and penetrate into the hair shaft itself, you have a well-conditioned head. And that's where you want to be because this will be able to take anything you dish out to it. We do a lot of things to our hair on a daily basis. Some of us shampoo our hair every two days. Some of us wet our hair every day. Some of us wear curly hair, straight hair, either we're wrapping it, we're rolling it, we're round brushing it. And Stella is not just an African-American product. This is a product that goes across the board. I am a hairstylist that has a multicultural clientele. You never know who's gonna be sitting in my chair. Why? Because I believe everybody should be beautiful no matter what. So, I can use this on everyone, and it gives me the same result. I have a young lady who I change her hair color with the seasons or with the change of her mind, and she does high lift platinums, she does reds, she does purples. On your hair network, you will see some of my work. And so, when you see that, I use Stella on her. And when I use Stella on her, that gets her hair prepared for whatever I want to do with it. So, right now, my young lady's under the steamer. I think she's got about five more minutes to go. We're going to do a nice rinse, a blow, and then I will show you my finished product. After that, you're going to see shiny, flowing, beautiful blonde hair. And everybody knows. Anybody who does blondes, no, blondes have no shine. I'm going to show you where blondes have shine. 
they have natural shine. And I've done Platinum Blonde, and I've used Stella Conditioner after a Platinum Blonde, and that hair is shiny and absolutely beautiful. Number one thing that you're going to do after a steam treatment is let that hair cool. Never take it from steam hot to steam rinse. You're going to let this, this work its magic, let it cool. Let everything set and settle back in. That's the difference between you being rushed in and out and an elite spa treatment. You have to take your time. And it's not a lot of time. When you really look at the gamut of the whole thing, Either you're going to do, you can do an extra 15 minutes. What's an extra 15 minutes out of getting your hair done? It's not a lot of time compared to the rest of your 24 hours. So we're going to let that cool. What I do is I like to move the hair around. Get another massage treatment in there. Mr. D is, has a fabulous college. I wish you guys could see what I see. He is going to be on the bicusp of all kind of education, and pretty soon, I hate to say it, it pays to have a cosmetology license. If you want to go further in life, if you want to start doing star's hair, if you want to start doing rapper's hair, if you want to start cutting basketball players' hair, you're going to have to get in the union. You know, the way you can get in the union is to be a master cosmetologist. You cannot be a kitchen beautician and take your business any further because you're going to limit yourself. And when you limit yourself and you limit what you can do, this is a $12. billion industry a year. You want a piece of that pie. So if you're going to be part of that pie, make sure that you're licensed. And he's got what you need in here. I went to hair school so long ago, and our hair school was not as nice as this. All righty. We're going to do a tempered water rinse. Come on back. Tempered water means it's kind of cool, kind of warm. You don't ever want to rinse a conditioner in hot, hot water. I always have one line that I always give all of my clients. Hate me now, love me later. Hate me now, love me later. Yeah, she's squinching up. It's cool. It's tempted. It's going to feel a little bit cooler because she just got out of a steamer. And this conditioner has some special stuff in it. So you will see the residual, any flakes that were left, you'll see them go right down the drain and out on the scalp. Oh, I know your stylus is so mean, this tempered water is... That cool water brings in shine. It doesn't close your pores down, it closes your cuticles down. So when we close that flap down, then that means that flap retains the nutrients, but we get rid of the residue of the conditioner. And that's what you want. You want to get rid of the residue. Are you comfortable, Miss Carol? Mm-hmm. Good. Rinse until your water is clear, or have your stylus rinse until your water is clear. We are not wringing out towels. We are removing water from hair, so you don't have to be rough with it. When you're rough with hair with a towel or with your hands, you ruffle up that cuticle and cause it to tangle back up. You're going to see something that most people... Hold on. There we go. We're going to go straight into her blow dry. And you see, I'm just holding that hair. I'm not ruffling it up. That gets all the water out. 
We're going to change Miss Sam's towel. Once again, wet towels are no fun. Now we're going to blow dry. And you're going to say, Diddy, but you didn't comb out her hair. If your blow dryer has a comb and you've used the right product, that's one step your stylist doesn't have to do. Uh-oh. Well, Miss Dee Dee. Yes. I tell you, everything that you've done today is really exciting. I'm ready to sit down myself in that chair to get this new Elite Spa Salon treatment with Stella Products. Uh, just looking at Miss Sam's hair, it feels good. It she, doesn't it? She's natural. She's got a nice curl pattern to she it. She does. She does. How does that scalp feel? It feels wonderful. Oh, that is so awesome. So awesome. So. Miss Dee Dee, you're going to go ahead and blow dry? Yes, ma'am, I am. Okay. Right now, let, we're going to do a summary of what we've done. We have done the hot oil scalp massage, the two shampoos. Remember that hot oil scalp massage needs to go underneath the dryer for 10 minutes. You do your two shampoos with the same product. Then you go under the steamer with our liquid platinum, which is our conditioner for the Elite Spa treatment. You blow dry and you style. Now, this is her style, and this is on plat this is on a high lift blonde. We're gonna finish off her styling for you, and we're gonna use the non-oil oil oh, drop sheen. oil sheen, which is phenomenal. She's got fine hair, so this is not going to weigh her hair down. It's gonna give her great shine. But let me tell you this. The reason why Stella is needed and the reason why education is needed, we have to stop doing old-fashioned hair. Scratching the scalp injures the scalp. It causes the scalp to be overloaded with extra sebum, which is your sebaceous glands, which are your oil glands. And if you treat dandruff and dry scalp as a scab, you would never pick a scab. So never pick your dandruff, never pick your dry scalp. Never pick your psoriasis, never pick your eczema. So you never want to take a small tooth comb and start digging. And the reason, you injure the scalp, you harm the scalp, you hurt the scalp. And it does it no good because it comes back even stronger, even tougher, and it's harder to remove. So you want to exfoliate with the salicylic acid and with the hot oils. And then that way, you will notice that your dry scalp doesn't return as fast, it does, it's not as thick, it, is not, it doesn't have that odor that it used to have, and you will notice that the scalp itself improves to a point that you rejuvenate and renew the scalp. And we all need skin that's renewed, scalps that are rejuvenated, because when skin and scalp is renewed, hair is renewed and you get a thicker scalp, you get a, you get a thicker strand, even when hair is fine, even when hair is, uh-oh. See, we're not all perfect. We drop stuff, it's okay. We always wanna protect that hair. And with protecting that hair, you have to protect that scalp. So, what you wanna do is ask your stylist, have you heard about Stella? Stylists, ask us, what would you like to know about Stella? We're going to be giving classes and more webinars. This is our oil-free oil. This is also liquid platinum. You can spray from a distance. It gives that hair that oil and protection. As you can see in the camera, she's got some flyaways. Everybody has natural flyaways. All I have to do is rub down. She still has lots of volume, lots of body, lots of movement. See that movement? That's what you want your hair to be like. You want movement, forward, backward movement, especially when you're doing your cuts, especially when you have your colors. You have to have movement in the hair so that the hair can seem multidimensional.
I thank you for watching. Miss Tracy thanks you for watching. This is and will always be a elite spa treatment. So ask your stylist, your stylist, tell them to get a representative. We will be where you need to be so you can too have a spa treatment. Here at Stella, we want you to be beautiful from Stella head to toe. Realize your own beauty. And thank you for watching. Miss Tracy? Thank you so much, Miss Dee Dee. And Miss Sam, her hair is gorgeous. I am just so excited that it not only feels good, it looks good, and it has so much body. And we're looking at blonde, and we know that it is really hard to give blonde hair a shine. And her hair is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. You can just finger it through very, very easily. I also want to thank Mr. D at Cold Cutters College. Again, if you're looking for a school, please don't hesitate to give them a call. Look them up online. Cold Cutters College. Ms. Dee, thank, thank you. you. So much. You're welcome. And I want to invite all beauty industry professionals to your hair network. Please join us. This is an opportunity for you to learn so much more about our industry, what the industry has to offer. Your Hair Network will be coming to you with more webinars. We have international and national platform artists. So everyone from Ms. Didi's level on up. And Ms. Didi is really up there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I just want to let you know, um, the next thing that we're going to have with Stella products is, as you can already see, Stella is color friendly. She's very color friendly. That next webinar, Ms. Didi is going to talk about and show you guys about putting that color on the hair and how Stella will protect it. And you can see that again right here. So thank you so much. Join us again at Your Hair Network. That's www.yourhairnetwork.com. Thank you so much and have a blessed day. Have a blessed day.